Welcome to the medical drama that left an indelible mark on television history recent. Elsewhere, as we revisit this classic series that aired from 1982 to 1988, one cannot help but wonder, are there any lesser known facts or anecdotes about this TV series that fascinate you? Before we delve into the enigmatic world of Sint, Elegius Hospital, let's take a moment to reflect on the impact it had on viewers. For many, this series wasn't merely a depiction of hospital life, but a mirror reflecting the complexities of human relationships and the harsh realities of the medical profession. Its narrative prowess, tackling poignant issues with a touch of realism, set it apart in an era dominated by conventional medical dramas. Now, as we navigate through the corridors of Sint, Elegius, here's a question to ponder. Can you share a personal story of how this TV series has inspired or impacted your life? Whether it prompted a career choice, ignited a passion for storytelling, or served as a source of solace during challenging times, Sint. Elsewhere holds a unique place in the hearts of its viewers. And now, for those eager for some behind-the-scenes insights, did you know that the show's finale, infamous for its unexpected twist, sparked debates and discussions that lingered for years? The series' innovative approach to storytelling and willingness to challenge traditional norms solidified its legacy as more than just a medical drama. As we revisit this TV gem, we're curious, what's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to Sint? Elsewhere, whether it's a specific episode that resonated with you or a connection forged with the characters, we would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. So, as we embark on this journey down memory lane, let the tales unfold and let the anecdotes resonate. Sint. Elsewhere, a series that transcended the screen continues to captivate audiences with its timeless narrative. Sent Elsewhere, a groundbreaking medical drama that premiered in 1982, defied conventions, and set new standards in television storytelling. Developed by Joshua Brand and John Falsey, the series was initially conceived as a response to the cliques prevalent in medical dramas of the time. Set in Boston's fictional Sint, Elegius Hospital, the show delved into the lives of doctors, nurses, and patients, offering a gritty and realistic portrayal of the medical profession. The ensemble cast featured memorable characters such as Dr. Donald Westfall, played by Ed Flanders, and Dr. Mark Craig, portrayed by William Daniels. The series stood out not only for its intricate character development, but also for its willingness to tackle complex and controversial issues, including AIDS, mental illness, and ethical dilemmas in the medical field. One of the show's defining features was its unique narrative structure, highlighted by its infamous series finale that left viewers questioning the very reality of the Sint. Elsewhere Universe This twist ending, where the entire series was revealed to be a product of an autistic child's imagination, sparked intense discussions, and has since become one of the most debated conclusions in television history. Sint Elsewhere left an indelible mark on popular culture, influencing subsequent medical dramas, and setting a precedent for nuanced storytelling on television. Its impact extended beyond the medical genre, contributing to the evolution of serialized storytelling, and paving the way for more complex narratives in television. The show's legacy endures as a testament to its bold storytelling choices, and the lasting impact it had on the television landscape making it a classic that continues to be remembered and analyzed by both critics and fans alike. The show, despite not winning high ratings, secured a six-season run on NBC by targeting the educated 18-49 demographic. Its longevity was fueled by a unique approach to humor and side jokes were woven into the fabric of the series. Characters were named after the show's staff and clever lines referenced various TV shows, movies, plays, and books. Interestingly, the writers shared a building and copy machine with the creators of Hill Street Blues, finding inspiration in their scripts. This dynamic exchange pushed both shows to continually improve. Sent Elsewhere's ability to connect with a specific audience and its witty, intertextual humor contributed to its lasting impact, making it more than just a medical drama. It became a cultural touchstone. In one memorable episode of the 1982 TV series Sint. Elsewhere, Dr. Axelrod and Paul, Luther Hawkins attempt to lift the spirits of the shot Dr. Fiscus. Their unconventional method involves blowing up rubber surgical gloves and placing them over their heads, a failed attempt that prompts Axelrod to reference a guy on TV who got big laughs doing the same bit. 
Interestingly, this comedic touch was a nod to Howie Mandel, who portrayed Dr. Fiscus in the series. Such moments of intertextual humor seamlessly woven into the show's fabric added a distinctive layer to Sint. Elsewhere's narrative. It's just one example of the clever and often subtle references that made the series more than a medical drama, turning it into a cultural touchstone for its audience. Warren Cool Coolidge, the orderly in the 1982 TV series Sint, elsewhere added a unique layer to the show's narrative. Interestingly, the actor portraying Coolidge also played the same character in The White Shadow. In a nod to this crossover, an episode showcased Coolidge donning his Carver High School varsity letter from Shadow. Additionally, an amusing mix-up occurred when an actor from Shadow played a different role in Sint. Elsewhere, and the character was mistakenly referred to by his Shadow name. The actor corrected this on camera. This intertextual connection between Sint. Elsewhere, and the White Shadow illustrates the show's attention to detail and clever nods to its characters' backgrounds. As the series delved into the lives of medical professionals at St. Elegius Hospital, these subtle connections added depth to the characters and resonated with the audience. The portrayal of Coolidge and the intertwined references from the White Shadow Showcase St. Elsewhere's commitment to nuanced storytelling and its ability to engage viewers beyond the medical drama genre. These details contributed to the show's lasting impact turning it into a cultural touchstone for its audience. Norman Lloyd's pivotal role as Dr. Daniel Auschlander in the 1982 TV series Sint. Elsewhere was more than just a casting choice. It was a testament to the show's emphasis on personal connections. Lifelong friends with Bruce Paltrow's family, Lloyd was initially slated for a brief four-episode stint. However, the chemistry and audience response led to an extended stay until the series' conclusion. This unique casting decision exemplifies the show's commitment to authenticity and the value it placed on relationships within its production. From its inception, Scent Elsewhere went beyond conventional casting practices, setting the stage for a series that would be as noteworthy for its behind-the-scenes connections as for its groundbreaking storytelling. Norman Lloyd's enduring presence on the show became a microcosm of the broader network of relationships that fueled Sint. Elsewhere's success, both on and off the screen. As we bid adieu to the captivating realm of Sint. Elsewhere, let the echoes of the Boston-based drama linger in the corridors of your memories. Like a skilled surgeon, this 1982 TV series delicately dissected the human condition, exploring the delicate balance between life and death, hope and despair. As you reflect on the intricate tapestry of characters that once graced your screen, consider the emotional surgery scent elsewhere performed on your heart. Was it the enigmatic Dr. Craig's relentless pursuit of excellence, or the compassionate Dr. Westfall navigating the tumultuous seas of his personal and professional life? Perhaps it was the ensemble cast that wove a complex narrative, stitching together the joys and sorrows of a fictitious yet intimately relatable world. Share your thoughts, your favorite moments, the scenes that stitched themselves into the fabric of your emotions. Did the series leave an indelible mark on your soul, or did it serve as a comforting companion during challenging times? In this collective journey through the halls of Sint, Elegious Hospital, every viewer became a silent part of the medical team, witnessing the triumphs and tribulations that mirrored the very essence of our own existence. Your connection to the series is a testament to the enduring power of storytelling and its ability to transcend the confines of time and space. As we close this chapter, thank you for sharing this journey through the intricate web of Sint. Elsewhere, your memories and reflections enrich the narrative ensuring that the spirit of the series lives on in the hearts of those who walked its fictional halls. Until our paths cross again in the realms of storytelling, thank you for your time and the privilege of sharing this emotional journey with you. May your memories of Sint elsewhere be as timeless as the tales it told.